Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Fish React Pack YouTube channel. And today we have something extremely special. I had somebody reach out to me in an Instagram DM and he asked if he could build me, April, and Trey custom rods. Now Trey is actually, well, he's here right now somewhere. I'm not sure, I can't remember correctly because it's been a while since I actually saw the message. I'm not sure if he builds custom rods like uh, like as like a side hobby, a side job type thing. But feel free to reach out to him if you guys want a custom rod built as well. I have no idea what these look like. It was totally a surprise other than the color. He said, what colors do you and April want? So I think I picked royal blue and I think April picked teal. So the goal today, I've never in the, holy smokes, seven, maybe eight years since I've been doing YouTube, I've never used a custom rod for bass fishing. I've done a lot of offshore fishing videos and stuff like that back in the day and used custom rods, but I've never used a custom, a, tr a true custom rod for bass fishing. Now, I'm super excited because I've used, you guys, I mean, was with Guggen for three or four years, used their stuff all the time, used the Bass Pro rods. I actually have a Bass Pro rod sitting right there. I've got Academy rods, every other kind of rod you can think of. Um, I've used six cents rods are good. God, St. Croix, Shimano, everything. Just never used a custom rod and I'm super excited about it. I'm so excited, in fact, that I can't figure out how to get this open. Oh, he made it childproof, which is good for me. Okay. Well, these things ship very safe, that's for sure. Come on, dude. We'll be back in just one second. All right, here we go. The moment of truth. Oh my God. A&E Customs, handmade fishing rods. Look at this. Come show them this. God, he killed it with the colors. It's got like carbon fiber in it. Look at the handles. Feel that handle. God, that's crazy. That's so sick. All right. I don't remember anything other than he said, what color rods do you guys want? This here. Dang, that feels so good too. There's gotta be a better way to do this. I'm always bad about this. I don't wanna, do it. I don't wanna break it before I buy it. Yes, please. Rule number one, I think, is like don't cut towards yourself. I think that's a rule somewhere. I can't remember that. Yeah. I think my dad taught me that when I was like five. <clears throat> my dad was a kid. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> well, I won't make the video. All right, here we go. April finally got him out for me, thank goodness, because I was, I'm not the best getter outer of a box fishing rod person. 7.2 medium heavy, fast. Absolutely perfect for anything pond hopping related. And then April has. A six foot nine medium heavy fast. That, God, that's insane. He killed it <clears throat> on these colors. I just want to highlight this again. A&E Customs. Now, I, I believe, if I hadn't said this already, I believe it's him and his son that make these rods. I, I don't, I can't remember if he said they just do it for fun or if they actually do it and, you know, they sell them or whatever. So like I said, his stuff uh, popped up on the screen earlier. It'll be linked down below. You guys can feel free to reach out to him if you guys want to check this out. But huge thank you for building these rods for us and we uh we've already got our bags packed the car is loaded we just need to put some reels on these rods and uh and go truly put them to the test so i think i might go with an slx because i like the blue and the black it'll, it'll match pretty good uh you might i don't know we'll have to find the corrado i think the corrado will probably be good with for for this one but uh either way we've got our custom rods first time ever using custom rods for bass fishing. Super pumped, let's get on the water and let's get to fishing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are here. April has a Corrado on her custom rod and I went with the SLX because it kind of matches the rod. So we, uh, we're we gonna get rigged up and hopefully, hopefully catch some absolute units today. It's a beautiful day out here in sunny, not South Florida, but Florida. I also forgot to take the braid off of this and put just straight, um, like, 15-pound fluoro. What are you going to do? I will do a leader. Leader. 
God, these rods feel so good. Not even, I literally even took a cast with them yet. Crazy. What are you going to start with? What are you thinking? Um, probably a lizard. Lizard. Look at this lizzy lizzy. Never fails. I don't think we need the same thing in our bags. So no, wanna, I'm doing separate. Yeah, if you so, want to do like. Yeah, that's you know what I'm doing. This, see, this one's gray, so that's mine. The one with the black is yours. Oh, I didn't even notice they were different. I thought they were the same as that little fanny pack. I just noticed that, so I was like. Which one's mine? The one with the black. Okay. I'm going to get a long leader today because. Where'd your stippies go? I get a. I, if, ever, if I ever have to tie a leader, I usually go with like a long leader because throughout the day, you're going to end up you know retying switching baits all kinds of stuff so it's a little bit easier if you just have a long leader and you don't have to worry about tying another leader just don't mess your leader knot up watch me say that and lose a freaking unit today i am super fun to use these rods though for real me too what are you gonna start with you said I thought we need to name our rods because they're custom to us should we name them yeah i think because they're our rods are custom to us I don't know but that you gotta I've, use them to name them. Like you gotta feel it yeah, out. You gotta feel it out. I was about to say, I don't know that I've ever named a fishing rod. But, but that you've does. never had a custom rod. Never had a custom rod. So you've never known to name it. That's true. Like you gotta name your boat too, right? Yeah. So you name your boat. You name your rod. Like this, this rod was built for you, and that one was built for me. That is true. I think I will, and I might. I love the height on mine. The length, the six the nine. Length, yeah. yeah six foot nine medium heavy that's a freaking anything from a six nine medium heavy to a seven three medium heavy is like the ultimate pond hopping rod like it just don't get better than that like you need i feel like a six nine medium heavy or a six six nine to a six ten or excuse me like a six eight to a six ten is, is good for like a it's like a good april size yeah rod. i like that a lot and then like if you're uh i'm not tall by no means i think i'm like five ten or something like that but um here seven two seven three that's my favorite i know you like where's your weight at you got right it right here i know you love doing this part that's why i let you do it thank you so much i really appreciate you letting me rig your rod up you're welcome anytime 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 any day yeah that's the that's not sapphire blue that's like purplish blackish blue we'll, we'll start with this and see how the day goes worst case we'll do some switching let the fish the tell keys? us what they want to eat today. It's not summertime yet, but it's getting kind of warm, so we'll just see what they want. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. Should I take this off? Uh, yeah, and just so fanny pack and blanket. Forgot my fishing glasses. That's tough. That's always tough. I can't even be outside without sunglasses on. Well, I got these sunglasses, but I don't got my fishing sunglasses. Yeah, that's like. These are just my like beach sunglasses. After I lose them, I lose them. Yeah. You think they're deeper now? I'd say so. I think we'll find some. Ooh, there you go. There you go. Come on. There you I'm go. Come on, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on. Oh, oh, he no. came off. I knew that hook set wasn't it. I seen it. You leaned into him. That was good, though. Where was that last cast at? Right, just in the middle. In the middle? Good sign. Good sign. That was that surprise fish. You didn't even think it was going to be there. It's, mm -hmm. it's there. I was just going to tell you, like, reset the hook on him. Come on. Come oh, on. are you on? Come on. Make sure you got the hook set good. There you go. Good job. There you go. I knew there was going to be good something job. like that. I knew it. Huh. Huh. Don't reel them all the way up. You got it. Okay. Let's go. I got one. Let's go, babe. First fish of the day. First yeah. fish. And I just had to name my Here. rod Lucy. First fish on the brand new custom rod? Lucy. Lucy is her name. I like that. That's pretty. Lucy. Lucy is her name and fishing is her game. 
God, that's a good one to start the that's day off with. Awesome. Right What'd you get? The lizard? The Slizzy Lizzy. The Slizzy Lizzy never fails. Let's freaking go. Here we go. First fish of the day. Let's go. Let's get you back here. Good job. Lucy. Lucy. Putting in work. Lucy. Oh, Lucy. Getting at it. Looks like there's one right there. I think there is one right here. Right where you're down. I know. I knew when you made that cast. That was a good cast. Yeah, I like just it. knew. I was like, there's like a 97.6% chance there's going to be something sick. When right I there. made that cast, I was like, I can't believe TJ hasn't made this cast yet. Uh, you know, I know you probably won't believe it when I tell you, but I, I saved that one for you. That's why I just made this cast because I knew you were going to pass me and want to make that cast. Believe me or not, I saved it for you. Not saying I could have caught the fish. But I definitely saved that cast for you. Well, thank you. That was so sweet of you. It freaking went after his little place. You did good at like making sure the hook was set that time too. You like kind of, you kind of, you could like the hook's already in. You just kind of reset it. You know what I mean? Hook them harder. Hook them harder. You know what they call me? The weekend hooker. Weekend hooker. Oh, I should have worn my shirt today. It's in the car. I know. I calculated it so it wouldn't happen. It did you? Yes. I think you might have miscalculated just a tad bit. So now that you've got like three bites and I've got none, how are you fishing yours? Slow. Slow? Reeling it slow? Or like real? Slow. Okay. I'm just kidding. I'm, I'm going super, super fast. Oh, is that what you're doing? <laughs> yeah. Are you letting it sink to the bottom before you start reeling? One, two, three. Okay. Like you told me. I'm now at the point in my fishing YouTube career where I asked April for... Oh, I just missed one. Just as You literally said do with that and I just missed it. Dead center out in the middle. I'm at the point in my YouTube career where I now have to ask April for fishing tips. Because if I don't, she'll just blow me out of the water. I got one. There we go. There you oh, go. it came off. I, my drag slipped. I knew it was going to happen too because my drag slipped. Oh, man. That's tragic. Where'd that you was catch a good him? one. In the middle? Yeah. God dang, son. Why, was my, why would my drag slip when I'm. I heard it. Oh, that's tough. I should have, uh, before we left today. I should have relined with uh, like 15 fluorocarbon instead of doing braid to a liter. Should have did it. I know, with the <sighs> running out of time. Let me tell you something funny. Say again? I messed with it before we got here. Thank you. Okay. I've done that to Norm before. Really? Loosen his drag before we went out fishing. How would you do so much? Uh, until after he misses. Overheat. Well, ladies and gentlemen, our GoPros both just overheated. We got them cooling down, sitting right here on the ground. And uh, I'm gonna make sure that that bass did not just mess my line up. But this is a perfect time for me to tell you guys about today's video sponsor, Jackpot Party Casino. Jackpot Party Casino is one of the largest social casino free to play apps from SciPlay, which is also a global market leader in social casino and casual gaming. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, that's correct. You heard me right. Oh, almost backlash my reel. Carnival's offering 150 cruise tickets all you have to do is literally download Jackpot Party, reach level two, enter your information to join the giveaway, keep playing to win more in-game prizes, and boost your chances to win. There's tons and tons and tons. It just keeps going and going and going. As you level up, you unlock new game types. So you already know your boy. I've been putting in work on this game. I'm level 56 already. Let me find, I'm gonna show you guys my favorite one. I just got up there it is right there i won 840 million dollars on this last night let's spin this bad boy up two million dollar bet million dollar profit just like that another one of my favorites the super jackpot party now this one this one is fun 
We're gonna go ahead and run a uh, $1.5 million bet. We didn't win, that's okay though. Boom, win, just like that, 750,000. We back up, baby, and I just leveled up. Every time you level up, you get $2 million. I think our GoPros are good to go now, boys, but as you guys can see, Jackpot Party Casino gathers many famous Las Vegas slots and games into one exciting party of casino games full of spins, wins, and fun. And as you can see, you can play it anywhere. You can play it taking a walk. You can play it at work, during lunch though, not, not during work hours, during lunch. You can play it when you gotta take a break in the shade unless your GoPro's cool down while you're fishing. You can literally play this game anywhere. Also, right now, you've got the chance to win special discount promo codes and even a free Carnival Cruise once you reach the set goal within the game. So make sure you guys check the link in the description, download Jackpot Party, and try to win a cruise because I'm telling you right now, the Lord knows I'd love to go on a cruise. So huge shout out to Jackpot Party Casino for sponsoring today's video. Now, let's continue our bass fishing mission. Wow, I was about to stop that cart and get me a drink. Hey, I thought about it too. We've been here, like, ow, dude, hold up, ow, ow. I thought about that, stopping the cart girl and be like, yo, uh, uh, even though we're fishing, not golfing, can we get something to drink? I, mean, I don't think they would say no because they work off tips. Do they? Yeah. Oh, yeah, they probably would stop. Let's try that. Next time we see a cart girl, I'll just be like, hey, <laughs> let me get something to drink. All right, boys, relocated ponds. Got some new baits tied on. Let's just see what we can do. Oh, this one looks good. All these ponds are like also super, super full right now because there was some massive storms that have been coming through Florida's uh, north, like North Florida. There we go. Oh, you fricker. Why you let it go? Why not just take it? Have you figured out what you want to name your rod? Because I have an idea. What's your idea? I named mine Lucy. You know what? I love Lucy. Mm -hmm. What's her husband's name? I don't know. Ricky. Ricky? Is it Ricky? I don't know. I've no clue. Oh, I just got broke off. I just got broke off and I knew that was going to happen. I watched him eat it. Oh my gosh. He hasn't jumped, so I don't think he's got the hook in his mouth, which is a good thing, but I 100% knew that that was about to happen. God, dude, I knew, I knew it, I knew it. He hawked it down. He hawked it down from the lily pads right there because I was coming right there to the right of him and he just whoop, he shot out and I seen him. And I got one that TJ just lost. Oh um. Are you broke off or no? April just lost a big one. Are you good? Yeah, Mentally? Mentally, no, she said. <laughs> okay, so me and April both literally within 30 seconds of each other just lost two good sized fish. I heard hers hit the water or uh, come out of the water. <laughs> Well, you know it's a freaking good one, son. Animal. Oh, she's got one. Animal. Let's go. Let's go. Ah, yes. Oh. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Oh. I lost my pay. I'm Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Oh. Once again, putting an absolute hurting on me. Holy smokes, good job. Oh. Where'd you catch that one at? I don't know, I don't know uh, spot burn you or nothing, but. Right under that tree. Dang, look at that. <laughs> good job, Did second fish. Get off? Yeah, I seen, well I was running over here and then I seen him just kind of making his way back to the water and he ran into that and that. So good job, awesome. Okay, I'm gonna throw him past this stuff. Yeah, you gotta get him past the nasty. Perfect. Good job. Good freaking job. Look, it absolutely tried to swallow my worm. Dang. And I need a new one. You need a new one. That's good. Dang, your rod's putting in work today. I'm telling you, Lucy, it's because you ain't named her. Ricky Ricardo. Ricky Ricardo. That's what 
I feel like people named Ricky would like the color blue, and I like the color blue, and I like people named Ricky. Ricky so I guess it only, it only makes sense. Ricky Ricardo is my rod's name now. Hey, make some noise when you catch a fish. Yeah, for my, my problem is uh, I'm on, I'm on. Are you serious? I swear to God, and I just got you off. Stop. Oh my God, straight out, stop. just like you said. Just like I said, as we're changing batteries, I told her to just cast straight out, Look. just to see what lived out there. Oh yeah, that was a fish. That's what I get for joking around. I need to be serious sometimes. <laughs> I'm about to walk a little ways that way. Where? Like that way. Oh my God, dude. Look at that. Oh man. I'm about to, if we weren't like four and a half miles away from the car, I would go re-spool this. I'm gonna have to retie like completely. Oh, let's come go. <laughs> they come off again? You might need a double set. Dude, you're... You're killing it. CJ, I think you're setting it too hard. Well, I just broke off again. How'd you break off? This line's got to be weak or something. Either weak or sunburned or whatever they call it. The line gets, um, sits in the sun too long or it's just old or something. Because that's two in a row that I've broke off on. And like sometimes when you're fishing, like you try to not get frustrated. But when that happens, it's kind of frustrating. I broke off on plenty of fish in my life, but I don't know that I've ever done that specific combo of losing a fish for my drag, breaking off, retying, retying my leader, retying my hook again, and then breaking off again. I don't know that I've ever done that sequence of events before. Let's loosen this up. I walked up and scared it. Oh, uh, you gonna try to take it from me? No, I don't care about that. I don't see him. I just want to Catch a fish, move, move, move. You're gonna come through. Oh, God. As soon as it hit the water, stay down. It feels big. Stay down, stay down, stay down, stay down, stay down. Oh, it's a go. Oh, it's a go. As soon as it hit the water. That's probably the one that chased me up. No, that was on the other side over there. Come here. Come here, big poppy. Oy. There you go. Oh. That's the one you've been waiting for all day. All day. Holy smokes. That's the one you've been wanting. From the other side, it landed. <sighs> Hooked him in the bottom. There you go. There you go. Oh. High five. Oh. Ricky's first catch. <sighs> Ricky's first catch. Solid, nah, a little skinny, two and a half, maybe, maybe right at three. A fish is a fish. Hey. Bass is bass. Yeah. Whew, smells very bassy too. Ricky's first catch. You did me good right there, Ricky. I'm proud of you, but holy smokes, that makes me happy. Literally tried to hit the other bank. I fell like five foot short. Let it sit for like two or three seconds, like April said earlier. Boom, boom, boom. Done deal. Thanks for playing, buddy. We'll catch you next time. That was a good, good catch too. <sighs> holy smokes. Yeah. That makes me happy. Right after I broke off. Twice. Yeah, because I've caught so many fish also. Oh, is that right? <laughs> Not being caught here. <laughs> you guys wouldn't believe me if I told you what just happened. I just broke off again. How? Casting. Just casting? Just casting. Just casting. <laughs> oh, good How Lord. did you do that? 
Yeah, look at that. I just, no cuts whatsoever. From that fish catch to me making sure my bait was good. That's kind of sad. I have 700 YouTube videos on this channel. And in those 700 videos, 685 of them probably are fishing specific videos. And I don't think ever in my life or in my YouTube career I have broke off that much in one day of fishing slash one YouTube video. So, I don't know. I don't know. Give me set and hook Third time's a charm though. Dang, this is just, oh my God, now, yeah, now can I can see it, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Good topwater bop. Yeah, you got a frog or something. I don't have any top water, anything. Are you dead serious? You're dead serious. Four times today. Four times. Four times I broke off. Four times. Did you have a bite? Four. Right there. Literally right there. Four times. Look. What else am I going to break off on? Four times today. There's one sitting right there. Watch. Let's just... Take a gander. Oh, he picked at it. Okay. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Come to daddy. Oh. Great. 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 You see him? Yep. Okay. What do you have in your bag right? Ah, uh, never I have mind. a lizard. I need a speed crawl. Blue rod, blue reel, blue braid, and 17 break offs. Put it all on blue. Put it all on blue. Here we go. Come on, baby. Come on. Just, just do it for me. Just do it for me one time. Just bite it one time. Come on. There you come go. On, there you go. On, come on. Come Make on. sure you set the hook. Yeah. Oh, that's a uh, good one. Come on. Oh my God, that's a good one. First cast. Let's freaking go. Oh, oh, Let's goodness. freaking go. Yeah. Oh, Came up with some cheese on them too. Look at that. Look at that. It looks that too. That is not even the cast I was gonna make. It's always the random ones that just yeah. make they make no sense. Once again, Lucy's on it. Lucy's on. I Look, love my new rod. I, I really do. That's got a really cool little gold spot right there on his on his yeah. noggin. Pretty pretty fish. Pretty pretty cool. We're gonna look. let this one go back down here. But there's more over here. Here you go. Look at it, it's so pretty. Got him, oh my God, dude. Holy smokes. I ain't gonna lie, that's not what I intended to do with that. It's not what I intended to do with that. What I intended to do was move some of that grass out. And that didn't work. There's like, this is not the one. There's another one? I don't know. I was just trying to like scoot some grass out of the way. And then I just, he just cranked it. There we go. There you go. Second fish, I think. I think yeah. I caught one. Second fish of the day for me. Uh, yeah. Second fish. Back it goes. I changed my battery. What are you doing, fricker? Oh, that was insane. Holy smokes. I didn't expect that to happen at all. That was 
boys, let me just, let me give you a little play by play of what just happened. Let me get this fish back in the water though. Cause this is, you wanna do it yourself? I mean, you're almost there, dude. There. Not the size we're looking for, but fun nonetheless. I was walking right here. I thought I seen a fish tail. So I was like, huh, if that's a fish, what are you doing? And then like, oh, it just happened that fast. I don't even know how to explain it. It's just freaking shark attack. It's crazy. Not what I expected to happen. Now we're tied up. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm just butt hurt, really. Like, I'm actually just butt hurt at how many fish I've lost today. Like, in 700 videos on this channel, I don't think I've ever lost this many fish. Like, in this manner. Like, breaking off. That just... I don't even understand. Come on. I'm on. I'm on. There you go. Yep, there we go. There you go. go. You should have named yours the whooping stick. Because you were whooping my booty. We were tied three to three. Now I'm up one. Yeah. You better stop. <laughs> that was a perfect ah. hook set, too. Oh, he'll find his way back. Oh, there you go. There he goes. There was my fish. <laughs> it was Jeez. up here. And now it's gone. Oh, Lucky Lucy over there. Or skilled, skilled Lucy, I think is what. Skilled Lucy. A what? A little bit. What kind? It's like a blue, a light, dark blue, and light blue flute kind of looking thing. Okay. We'll wait, this flute. We can go out this way. Mm -hmm. Hey, bro, what's up? I got a question. This dude's over here on the phone with security. Can we chill with y'all for like 10 minutes? It's because we're fishing. It's because you're fishing? Yeah. They're tripping. Security tells us not to fish on the golf course side. And uh, and we don't. <laughs> they were fishing all day yesterday. I should be fine. <laughs> yeah, I figured so. Yeah, it's that guy right over there in the gray shirt. <laughs> God, he's <laughs> tripping right now. Oh, dude, oh, yeah. There's too many. <laughs> Y'all have a good one, man. Is he still on the phone? He's taking pictures. Is he? Him right there. Is it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's the guy for real? Yeah, he just came by and he turned around. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'll just be like, oh man, sorry dude. I just got turned around and like I was just trying to find my way out and I just assumed this was the way. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we successfully survived, evaded, resisted and escaped golf course security yesterday was... it's funny because we are allowed to fish there uh and we just so happened to find this one pond that i think we'd only ever fished one time we decided to walk the house side of it which trey has done numerous times and i guess that guy uh and that usually happens that that guy said something oh he didn't even say anything to us he just straight called security and was like you gotta you gotta get here now they're they're out here at the pond and Pictures of me like I wasn't even in my best dress yesterday. <laughs> but yeah, he was like, they're they're at the pond and they're they're fishing and it's like, well, you know they are allowed to do that here, so not a big deal. Anyways, we dipped out on the uh, on security yesterday, but neither here nor there. The rods. All right, I'm gonna let you go first. 
What Bye -bye. did you What did you think about your rod? I love mine. I thought it was like the perfect pop. Length. Length. <laughs> it was the perfect length. So I can touch the tip. How did it handle fish? When you set the hook on a fish, how did it did it? Did I mean, it... you tell me when you seen me catch them all yesterday. Hmm. How many times did you break off? None. Hmm. Must be nice. It is pretty nice. Fancy pants. Oh, Mr. Fancy Pants. Is that all you got? Uh, I think. Alright. Oh, and uh, Lucy did really good yesterday. Okay. <laughs> good job. And I will actually want this, this same setup like this, but in a spinning combo. Mmm, that'd be nasty. Yeah. In a good way. All right, so I figured out why after talking to uh, a professional fisherman friend of mine, uh, Luke Norman, fishing with Norm, I figured out why I kept breaking off yesterday. And that was because I had a 30 pound braid and I had a 12 pound fluorocarbon leader. So when I was setting the hook, the braid was just so strong, it was just making me snap off. So we won't make that mistake again and I will reline this reel with some uh, 15 pound fluorocarbon straight up. Anyways, about the rod, so usually I prefer a shorter handle on my rod, but for some reason, I can't quite put my finger on it. I don't know if it's the balance of the rod or if it's this specific type of uh, material. It looks carbon fiber. It's not, it's some kind of like, I don't know, feel good material. I don't know how to explain it. I'm no rod expert. I guess I probably should be though, cause I'm a YouTube fisherman. Goodness, TJ. But for some reason, this one felt really good in the hand. It just balanced perfect like it feels perfect and then having that handle under my arm like that it just felt great the length of the rod 72 medium heavy fast it's literally perfect like i said at the beginning of the video it, it, you, if you're pond fishing primarily you can't get any better than like a seven foot to a seven foot three medium heavy i personally feel like a seven two medium heavy fast is that sweet spot right in the middle the looks of the rod though that doesn't have much to do with the functionality of the rod the looks 10 out of 10 absolutely love it evan and his son absolutely killed it on these rods so with that being said we're going to put these to a lot more use throughout the the rest of this spring into summer and uh hopefully you guys will see one of us break our pb on these rods right here but with that said i love you guys thank you for watching make sure you guys check out jackpot party casino linked in the description and the pinned comment love you guys catch you on the next adventure peace